2011, a youth gun violence action plan. The Savannah police chief says shootings involving children are rising at an alarming rate. He spoke exclusively tonight with our Nakaya Carrero. 51 kids ranging from the ages of 1 to 18 years old were either struck or killed in a shooting in 2021. Chief Roy Minter tells me while the city decreased in shootings overall, it's still a community issue that needs to be addressed. Anytime we have a shooting in our community, it causes a concern because it impacts someone and some family in our community. Savannah Police Department says there were 24 shootings where the person who fired the gun was between the ages of 5 and 18. I mean, unfortunately, we've had a couple of really ugly, unfortunate incidents where we had a 14 year old um, who was shot and killed by a suspect who was 18 years old. And then also we had a 17 year old um, who was arrested and is being held in connection with the murder of another 17 year old. A few weeks ago, we heard from kids in the Savannah area about how they feel about gun violence. Having guns, there ain't no real purpose to it besides just killing. Which Minter saw. Um, how does that make you feel, you know, hearing that kids in Savannah are finding this as a normal trend? Well, that's concerning um, because we do not want people to feel that any type of violence or criminal behavior in our community is normal. Uh, whether it's young adults or young kids in our community or uh, older adults. With the arrival of the new year, Mentor says there is plans for a few different community programs to help lower those numbers. Office of Neighborhood Safety and Engagement that'll be coming online soon. Uh, the hiring of a new end gun violence director that is also part of that initiative. Um, kicking off our PAL League, our police, police athletics and activities league. Minter also mentioned one common problem they see is the access and availability to firearms. He said they are working to find a solution so that way the guns don't end up in the wrong hands. In Savannah, Nakaya Carrero, WJCL 22 News.